Precious Jesus, I give you glory. Holy Spirit, I ask for help to give glory to the King of Kings. Help me find the feelings of Christ Jesus and give him what his heart desires. Teach the bride how to tend to the heart of Yahweh. Thank you for your great love. We worship you in the splendor of your holiness. We bow before your eternal majesty. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised is his wonderful name. You are altogether lovely. You are precious. Be exalted, be glorified. Holy Spirit, turn the heart of the bride to the throne of God where beautiful Yeshua sits in unrivaled victory. Yes, your love is victorious. Your love knows no end. Your leadership is perfect. So we position ourselves in gratitude before your throne of glory. Holy Spirit, make us living epistles of prayer. Prayer saturated with adoration. Holy Spirit, possess us that we may partake in the presence of God. Isaiah 40, 11, Jesus will tend his flock like a shepherd. He will gather the lambs in his arms. He will carry them in his bosom and gently lead those that are with young. Oh, great shepherd, I worship you. I worship you. You are the shepherd who tends to his flock. So may we be the bride that tends to you. Let us rightly respond to the grace gift given of your glorious love. We must respond rightly to the broken body and poured out blood of Yeshua. Thank you. Holy Spirit, empower your bride with the spirit of supplication. Give us divine knowledge to in prayer tend to the heart of Yahweh. Mm, What a privilege, what an honor. The king of the universe makes vulnerable his heart, sharing his feelings with those who he has drawn near. And in the sharing, we find our ministry. We can minister to the feelings of God. By the power of the Holy Spirit, we can find the feelings of God and minister to a need within his heart. Glory to the Lamb. Thank you, Lord. Thank you that you gather us in your arms. We are your lambs and you gather us into your near embrace, under the shadow of your wings. You gather, you carry, you lead, you tend. There is no one like you. You are the good and faithful shepherd. You are the long-suffering bridegroom king. There is no one like you. So we yield, Holy Spirit, as you take us closer to the throne of grace, that we may be gathered under the arms of the Almighty. And to the wayward bride, I prophesy 
that by the power of the Holy Spirit, strong cords of love will draw you back to the arms of the Almighty and He will pick you up and carry you in His bosom. The privileged, the privileged place of the bride is the beautiful bosom of Christ Jesus. I give you glory. I give you glory. And as you carry us, may we lean our ear upon your chest and hear your divine heart beat. You are life itself. You do not need a heart to sustain you. But you are declaring John 1.14 that the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory. Your heart still beats now in the heavenly realms in your glorified body as a testimony of your grand love that God became man eternally. Divinity dressed itself with humanity in the name of love. And now you carry us. And in close proximity we lean upon the chest of our beloved and we hear your heart beat. We hear the voice of life resonate within your lungs that breathe like your bride. And at the source of holiness which is the abundance of your heart, we can hear the echoes of your voice before you even speak. That is the privilege of the bride. Thank you that you carry us in your bosom. Thank you that you gently lead those that are with young. You lead those who lead within the church. Those who have responsibility to feed the lambs and feed the sheep. You are the great shepherd that goes before us. You are the great warrior king that surrounds us with your great love. Your grace is like a shield of protection. So as we follow your leadership, may we lead your lambs rightly. Thank you. You gently lead. You are the most powerful God in all the ages, in all creation, in all the universe, but you lead with a gentle touch. You are lowly, you are humble, but you are all powerful. May we follow in the footsteps of our master. May we lead the church in this manner. May we be lowly and gentle, just beautiful Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you that you tend your flock. Thank you that you gather us under your arms. Thank you that you carry us in your bosom. And thank you that you gently lead us. There is no one like you, Jesus. I give you the glory. I worship your name. Beautiful Yahweh. All the glory, honor and praise. It is yours. Now and forevermore. It will always be yours. Your name alone deserves glory. I love you with all my heart. Amen.